All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Oh my god, the welcome back Carter intro. Yes, that's how old I am. But even though I'm old, I can still tear some shit up in these games built for kids. And I get into a real bad gunfight right there. Mr. Carter, I get into a real bad gunfight. Oh my god. Yo, I better stop before I start busting out my Epstein impersonations. All right, but anyway. <laughs> so I get into a real bad gulf right there and I get owned it. Look, people, we might not have to wait for next gen consoles to come out till we find ourselves a COD killer. Because I think the Call of Duty killer is already out now. You might be looking at it on your very screen right here. Now, watch this. My teammate marks this guy down in the distance, which is great. There's a perk that lets you mark people. Because it's hard as fuck to see people in this game. And Oh, I get a tag team. Whoop, there it is. And oh, get turned on, son. Get turned on. Oh, don't get turned on now. <laughs> Oh, did you guys see that shit? That was awesome. <laughs> Let's shoot this guy right here. And guys, I'm using the Scarab Mod 2 with the Rapid Fire perk, uh, Maneuverability, and uh, Auto Armor. Or as you crisis vets like to call it, Auto Bitch Pro. Now, watch how I get all played right here. Now, ah, man, I should have seen this dude. The water moving was a dead giveaway that he was invisible. But, uh, guys, I don't know, man. <laughs> I, I still suck at this game. Look, man, I'm learning. I'm still a noob. This is only my third day on this game. And even though it's only my third day, I think I got a pretty solid game here. I mean, as far as my Crisis 3 standards go, you guys know I don't have any fucking standards. I upload whatever I want. But if I could get a 20-plus kill game on this, which is actually really good, <laughs> um, I'm uploading it. I don't give a fuck. I had a bunch of deaths this game, but... It's all part of the learning process, man. It really is. And I'm having a lot of fun. I don't get frustrated or pissed off or annoyed when I play this game. And a lot of you guys always ask me about the connections. How are the connections in here? Is there lag comp? Is there skill-based matchmaking? Look, guys, I don't think there's any skill-based matchmaking in this game. Uh, there's not enough people playing it. I mean, there's lucky there's matchmaking at all. Look, as good of a game as this is, it's just another victim of Call of Duty. I mean... <laughs> So many people play Call of Duty, they don't even give any other games a chance. And look how horrible my aim is right there. What? <laughs> Come here, where are you going, son? You're cloaked ass over here. And I get a combo fire, which is pretty cool. And I pick up a maximum radar. And look, man, Call of Duty has just ruined all these other games out here. There's really nobody else giving any other games a chance just because all they do is play COD nonstop. Like, you see it all the time. Like, a lot of the people that play Call of Duty that I follow on Twitter, that's all they talk about is Call of Duty. They don't play no other games. And it's really unfortunate, man, because there's so many other great games out right now. And, oh, that's right, son, get denied. Do not pass go. Do not collect that $200. And, oh, I pick up a Swarmer. And, people, I'm getting good with this thing. Look at that. Oh, get beasted. I'm getting real good with this Swarmer, man. And, wait a minute. What happened? Why did I drop the Swarmer? All right, let me pick this thing back up. Come on now. Uh, hold X. And, huh? You know what? Fuck it, dude. All right, and we get a host migration. Somebody left. And yeah, let's get back to action. Okay, here we go. And look, man, if Call of Duty, if there really is a Call of Duty killer out there, which I'm sure there will be, man. Look, Call of Duty killed itself as far as I'm concerned. Call of Duty's it's like that old, decrepit man sitting in a wheelchair just waiting to die. I mean, the people are dying for a new game. The people are crying out for a new game to play. Hey, look, man, you guys need to go out and buy this game. I'm going to highly recommend that all of you watching this video right now that have not yet bought this game, go out and buy it. Like I said, buy it, rent it. You've got to try this. It is fun. You will enjoy it. And, oh, me and this dude took each other out. <laughs> me and this dude, Izorski. Me and this guy, Izorski, beast on each other all game long. Good shit, Izorski, man. <laughs> me and him, well, And I'm on a death streak right there. I edited out a couple of deaths after that because they were stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to cut this video down a little bit. And I go on a death streak, and it gives you just a little bit of an armor bonus, guys. It's not like, uh... It's not like Painkiller either, man. It's just... It's like Juggernaut. You you get, like, maybe one extra bullet protection. And watch me. Look, look at the moves. Oh, my God. Ah! So, me and this dude took each other out again. But as you can see, watching this gameplay, compared to my last Crisis gameplay, I'm getting a little bit better. And I think the best thing to do when you're getting shot at in this game is just move around like crazy. Like I said, man, I'm using maneuverability. It's like lightweight. And um, I really like how deep the multiplayer is. I'll show you guys a class I was using at the end of this video. And, I mean, even though I was on a death streak right there, guys, I was having fun, you know? I'm having fun playing this game. It's not like Call of Duty where you could be doing good and, and you're still pissed off. I don't know how many of you guys are subscribed to XCal. Hopefully all of you. 
If you don't know who Excalizors is, I'll put his link in the description. Please go check him out because he is a legend. He was one of the first guys I watched here on YouTube. And he deserves way more subs than he has. But then again, don't we all? And uh, Excal said something in a video once, and it was so true. He said the most fun he ever had playing Call of Duty is when he wasn't good at it, is when he was a noob, because he really wasn't expecting anything. And if you go into this game just playing it, really not expecting anything, just playing it for what it is and have fun, man, you'll enjoy it. You really will. Uh, I mean, Call of Duty, if you don't have lag comp on your side, and, and there's somebody else that's a second ahead of you, you're done. It doesn't even matter. Uh, in this game, I don't know if it's like that. Like I said, man, the connections in this game are kind of weird. I think there's only one guy on a four bar. And look at all those tags. Oh, no, all my teammates are going to take my tags. No. <laughs> so I shoot this guy right here. And look at all those tags. Are my teammates going to steal them like in Call of Duty? No. <laughs> I get taken out. Some guy jumps on the side. I mean, that's Izorski. Look at the battle me and Izorski are in. Five and five. Me and Izorski just beasting on each other like <laughs> King Kong and Godzilla from those old school monster movies back in the day. But check this out, guys. Now, look. I, I got killed. But look. All my tags are still there waiting for me. Isn't this nice? That's right. None of my teammates can scrounge my kills. Look at that. I just pick up all my kill, my tags, get my maximum radar. Now, there is a perk in this game that allows you to just auto pick up tags when you kill somebody. So you don't have to run around and pick them up. And the pro version of that is you get your streaks earlier. One, one kill earlier. And then the pro pro version of that is that they're more effective. So it's like the Danger Close Pro from uh, Modern Warfare 2. Yeah, really, really cool, man. Watch me. I get the Swarmer again and I get a kill. <laughs> <laughs> this gun is so beast, man. <laughs> I have a feeling that once I get used to this game, I'm really going to enjoy using that Swarmer more. And I pick up another kill right here. Now, I, I just go beast mode from here on out, guys. I think, uh-oh, <laughs> bad throw with the grenade. <laughs> yeah, not a good throw at all with that grenade. It came right back at me. <laughs> El Prez would call that the Chuck Knoblock. <laughs> so, and all right, so they get a radar up on me, so i got to be careful. I'm going to go cloaked. And I'm expecting a flow of traffic my way since I have the radar up on me. But that's all right, because I got the radar up on them. And I get a headshot, take that dude out, pick up my tag, and I get the EMP blast. So cool. I'm going to activate my EMP blast. It deactivates all their suits. They can't use maximum armor. They can't use their cloaking ability. They're pretty much done. It's like you took away their perks. That, that's what the EMP blast does. Like comparing it to COD, EMP blast would be taking out um, the enemy team's perks. Now I have 8 of 10 tags collected. I just need 2 more tags for my maximum nano suit. And I pick up another tag right there. <laughs> and I just need one more kill for that nano suit. I'm going to go cloaked. And you got to play smart when you play this game, people. you got to play smart. Now, here we go right here. So I go cloaked. And see this guy? And I pick up my nano suit. Oh, my goodness. So I'm going to activate it. Let's go. Max nano suit. And, guys, I have no idea what this does. <laughs> I don't know what maximum nano suit does. I think it's like Specialist from MW3, maybe. And look, look how fast I drop this guy. I drop that guy hella fast. And I jump up here. Three, two, one. Come on, Thunder. Ah, look how fast I kill that guy. Get beasted, baby. Challenge completed. Hell yeah. What you know about that maximum nano suit ponage, son? Get owned. Your boy Thunder, most lethal, the MVP. To drop 24 kills on these dudes. And what did Izorski do? I mean, look at Izorski. No wonder why he was beasting. He had that host pro. Izorski. <laughs> and uh, here we go, guys. Here's the match highlights. Uh, like a little montage at the end of the gameplay. Bam, bitch. Legend of Thunder. Legend of Thunder. Louder than Thor. That's right, son. Noobs hitting the floor all over the place. Get owned. One more kill. That's with the maximum nano suit right there at the end on Izorski's ass. That's right, Izorski. You had host pro, but your boy Thunder had that maximum nano suit pro. What you know about that? And here's a class I was using, guys. And look, man, I don't know what the maximum nano suit actually does. I think it maybe it's like specialist from MW3. I don't know. I know. It's embarrassing for me to upload a video title it max nano suit and me not even know what it does but that's just the nature of the business here on youtube people you just you know that's just the way it goes but i tell you what i'm gonna do my due diligence after i upload this i'm gonna go look up what maximum nano suit means so in the next gameplay i will tell you that's my homework for the next crisis 3 gameplay i will tell you what the maximum nano suit does so make sure you guys subscribe like favorite comment and subscribe and come on back to the next crisis gameplay where i will be unveiling what the maximum nano suit actually does <laughs> and here's the here's the class i was using guys i was using rapid fire maneuverability and uh, auto armor with the uh, m7 fra m17 frag grenade like i said man the grenades in this game are kind of cumbersome to use but maybe that's a good thing you don't want nade spam 
Uh, I was using Scarab Mode 2, Iron Sight, Muzzle Brake, Foregrip, AY69 with the Reflex Sight. Haven't unlocked the other attachments for it yet, but Crisis 3, a fantastic game. And look, man, we need new guys to buy this game because the lifeblood of every shooter on YouTube is noobs. And if we don't get some noobs <laughs> on this game soon, and we need some more Americans to buy this game so I can stop getting on foreign hosts all the time, that would be great too. So, like I said, man, guys, go out and get this game. I'm out here. I'm playing this game. I'm loving it. I'm waiting for you. You want to play with Thunder? Go get Crisis 3. And you can play with Thunder. I'll be out here waiting for you guys. All right. I'll see you on the next video. Thank you so much for watching as always. And I am out. Peace.